So welcome back to another episode of Spice and Wolf Remake. Now in this episode we're gonna be smuggling gold because in the previous episode Lawrence found out that basically there's no other way for him to fix his debt than to then with crime, right? So he got Nora on board. He sweet sweet talked her into helping him, and now Nora, Holo, and Lawrence are going to I forgot the country's name or the city's name, but to like a city that's down a very dangerous path. Because the prices of gold there are a lot cheaper than the prices of gold in the current city, so they're trying to smuggle some gold from there to the city using sheep. So that's why Nora is going with them, right? And I guess we'll find out if it works, if it doesn't, if they encounter any walls on the way, or what happens. So if you want to watch this Uncut Rumble, it's going to be on my Patreon, which is down in the description. And without further ado, let's go into Spice and Wolf Remake Episode 11. I'm excited. Here she is, Nora. I love Nora, by the way. She's adorable. Ah, Remeria? Remeria? So he's in the know as well. Oh, he is stressing. Look at the eye bags. Yeah, it does feel like a bit of a desperation play. For everyone in involved. Mm. Forest of walls and frigid terrain. She needs to rest early. Yeah, that's it, Hola. Yep. Yep.日時間は早めに休息を取るんです。よる日時たちが襲われないように張るために、今回の商売を成功させるためには。羊の無事が最優先です。だから、ノーラさんの指示に従うのが最良かと思います。申し訳ない。緊張して気が過ぎてしまう。狼が出ても慌てないでください。必ず持ちまで無事にお届けしますから。頼りにしています。神のご加護はあらんこと。なあ。ディオエスティ。大丈夫だろうか。大丈夫だろうか。大丈夫。すでに囲まれてます。<
and then they're gonna smuggle it back and then they're gonna exchange it exchange the gold back for money but they're gonna get more money out out of it right because obviously it's more valuable i don't know what the uh, commission fee is gonna end up being because usually if the discrepancy is not huge between the exchange rates i feel like the exchange no, fee this makes it not worth it. Lamtra, that's the あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あ
You both have your own moments. Yeah. あの、絵猫がですか私にほれておいのじゃる。お主からの寵愛は安泰じゃと思っておる。じゃから、たまには別のものとじゃれ合いたいと欲が出た時じゃ。男には、たまには即気なくしなければならぬ。それが良き尋
It's Hola? What the f- They'll use themselves as bait. Or at least that's the uh, cover up. Cover up plan. Yo, this would be such a red flag if they weren't the main characters. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it will. It will raise some questions. Ah, uh, I don't know. This is giving me a bad... Like, this is raising so many red flags, but I feel like it's holo. She'll be fine. Man, the OSC. まあ、他には持ってきていないようです。うん。なんとか逃げられましたね。ドレンさんたちも来ませんね。先を急ぎましょう。彼らの死を無駄にしてはいけません。死だなんて。な。まあ、失礼しました。いや、he Look, I get, I get him. He's like, I just have to get this to the city. No matter what. Whoa. Look at the eyes! <laughs> She's so cool! Horror. <laughs> She'll be fine. She'll be fine. She can't be that. She can't be that sassy and then lose. Lorenzさんですか。はい。ご無事だったんですね。ええ。リーベルトさんから聞いて紹介でただじっとしていることができなくて。ああ、でも戦略。うん。そうだったんですね。それでロレンさん、お荷物はえ、ああ、あちらに馬もそこにいます。そうですか。とりあえず。They're gonna attack him. They want the gold. They want the gold. They want the gold. They're gonna attack him. They think he has the gold. あのロレンさん、お連れの方はここにはいません。それは良かった。Yep. Yep. Nani, what a go, Motte, Kamaimasen. 
裏切るのかレベリオ紹介は保険ですよ。わかけっぷちなんです。可能な限り、危険は排除しなければならない。バーチ。女性がいると聞いていたので、気が重かったのですが、その点は幸いでした。お連れの方の方には渡しておきます。That's nice. またお会いしましょうと言えないことに、心が痛まないわけではありません。しかし、この後のことを考えると、本当に気がめいる。あっちは女だしな。お,おい、言うなまさか<笑>おとなしくしろブロー彼女には手を出すなあ<笑>あ、oh, ブロー !OK、never mind, these guys are completely trash. I was gonna say, they're just trying to survive, but they're just absolutely trash. あ、oh, あ the, the bruise! <笑>あああの娘もこいつみたいに縛って放り出しといたらどうだ狼が始末してくれるってことかバカを言えあれは羊の一頭も欠かさずこの森を抜けてくるような娘だどんな異教の呪術を使うかわからん目隠しして両手縛ってここに連れてきても生き延びるだろうよそうなったら破滅するのは我々だ確かになとはいえ気が重いあんな娘を手にかければしばらく飯も食えないだろうブローこいつとどめは刺さなくていいか刺したいかいやこっちも少ないもんそろそろ行くぞさっさとしないとリーベルトさんにどやされるそうだな They're keeping him alive? Why? What's the point then? You're gonna lose all cred if you keep him alive. しかし、あいつの連れの女が死んでいるくらで。I guess they're trying to leave him to the walls, so they're not the ones that kill him, but still. Because they're a merchant trading company, right? Wait, I'm gonna talk at the, at the end. It's, there's like basically nothing left. Mmm. Oh, I love this ending so much. And nothing else. Okay. So, what was I gonna say? Okay. Yeah. Um. Wait. What was I gonna say? Shoot. Yeah. What? What's the plan? Like, why do they keep them alive? Because obviously they're a trading company or like commercial company or whatever you want to call it, right? So their entire success is dependent completely on word of mouth, right? And their um. And their reputation, right? So it obviously makes sense why they would steal the gold, kill off everyone else, and be like the walls attacked, right? But if they leave him alive and he may goes back alive and talks about it, then obviously people are gonna be like, whoa, he's actually alive, he didn't get killed by walls, and he says that you stole the gold. I don't know. And they're gonna lose all cred, and then that destroys their, their company, right? So I feel like killing him would have been the safest bet. But I guess they did presume that the wolves are gonna kill him anyway, so it makes sense, I guess. Um, but anyways, apart from that... Oh... These guys are pieces of shit. It makes sense now why the uh, other guy was so abrasive and so quick to, like, accept Lawrence's proposal, right? Because he was always conspiring against them. Also, he has the gold, right? So... I mean, gold is now as good as Remerios, unless they get back alive and they're like, and they expose them somehow. Uh, I don't know who's gonna believe Lawrence because he's kind of gotten a reputation for himself in the city of like a beggar and stuff like that. So I don't know who's gonna believe him, but still, I, I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Um, and now I want to see the Holo matchup. That got me, that got me a bit hyped, man. Seeing Holo go up against like a younger... Wolf that's also like it's just huge. I don't know what those wolves are. Are they all like gods? Are they like deities? Or what are those huge wolves, you know? Or is it just like a random wolf that grew like like 10x the size that he should be? I don't know. But I'm excited, man. Also, the OST, oh my god, in this episode. Well, oh, sorry, in this episode was absolutely crazy. I love it. I hope Nora's okay as well. Man, I love Nora. I feel like she won't be directly. Oh no, she will be attacked. <laughs> Maybe her dog 
can help her out a bit. I don't know. But anyways, I'm going to end it here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.